Hi YouTube, it's Natural Me4C and today I'm going to be answering a question that we got from the Q&A Your Input video. Um, someone wanted to know what I have been doing with my hair at night. Um, so I have a video called Twist Out Maintenance that shows you know what my nighttime routine is. I have not changed a thing um, even though my hair has gotten longer. So what I'm going to do today is I'm going to show you once again what happens to my hair um, over the course of a couple days. This time however um, my hair does have gel in it so I'm going to show you what I'm waking up to in the morning over the next couple days and show you how I revamp my twist out without retwisting my hair at night. So this is day one of a twist out for me and this is what it looks like. Okay. <laughs> All right, so I do have gel in my hair today. Um, it is the Fantasia IC Styling Gel, Hair Polisher Styling Gel, <laughs> and the Curl and Shine Conditioner in my hair, along with, you know, avocado butter and olive oil. So on day one of a twist out, all I do is grab my satin bonnet. <laughs> so my bonnet is getting too small for my hair. In the meantime, until I find another bonnet, <laughs> I have been using, oh my gosh, you guys are probably going to laugh at me. <laughs> okay. Yes, this is a slip. Um, it is a skirt slip and it is made out of like the same material as my bonnet. So what I've been doing with the slip <laughs> is I have been taking it and it's very loose, okay? And I just put it on my head like this. <laughs> I just started doing this. Um, I think it's been like four days or so. All right. <laughs> and because it's obviously too long for my hair, I just tie it in the back. Okay, so that is all I do on day one. Um, I will see you all in the morning. All right, so it's the next morning. I slip held up really nice so okay don't knock it until you try it it really works okay so let's see what we got going on under here do not laugh okay <laughs> okay so yes my hair still is very smushed in the morning it kind of looks like this twist out's done but it is not, I promise you, and I'm going to show you what happens when I jump in the shower and refresh my hair with steam only. I'm not gonna wet my hair or anything, and I'm going to salvage my twist out from yesterday. Okay, so I'm all showered, I've gotten dressed, I got my makeup done. All right, so now I'm ready to do my hair. So once again, I did not wet my hair in the shower. Um, the back might have gotten like a couple drips here and there, but that's cool. <laughs> Other than that, I did not wet my hair. Um, I just let the steam get in there and I am now ready to style my hair for the day. So this is what my hair looks like once I'm out of the shower and the steam has woken it up some. All right, so I'm gonna get in here and I'm gonna start lifting my hair. It's waking it up. And at this point, you know, when I'm in here feeling around, um, I'm trying to see if I need to add any products or anything like that. So far, I'm not feeling like I need to add anything, so we'll see. <laughs> All I'm doing is pulling this out with my fingers, y'all. <laughs> Nothing fancy. I don't even think I'm going to use a pick today. Okay, so my hair to me looks pretty good. Um, so what I'm going to do is with my edges, okay, what I'm going to do is I'm going to take a little bit of the Curl and Shine Conditioner. Um, you can use like avocado butter, olive oil, um, or even the Shea Moisture Curling Style Milk, any kind of moisturizer that you want to use, you know, for your hairline. Um, I'm just going to try this out. And I'm just going to take a little bit, that much, and I'm just going to apply a little bit of this to my edges. Just to make sure, you know, that they're moisturized. This stuff smells so good. <laughs> All right, and I'm just going to take a little bit more of the Fantasia Icy Hair Polisher Styling Gel. Just barely any. And I'm going to apply that to my edges too. Take a baby brush. I want kind of more of a, a taper look. So I'm just going to take the sides of my hair and I'm going to bobby pin or pin these back a little bit. Okay, so I am all set, y'all. This takes like 
literally under probably like three minutes to do in the morning. It is just so fast. What I've noticed, seriously guys, sleeping with the slip, <laughs> um, my hair is more moisturized um, than it normally is with like my bonnet. So I'm really enjoying my slip, even though it looks a little crazy. <laughs> it seems to be working. So I will see you later on tonight to show you what I'm gonna do um, to prep my hair for tonight's sleep and show you what happens the next day. All right, I'll see you later. All right, so it is actually almost 11 o'clock at night, so I'm getting tired <laughs> and I need to go to sleep. Um, my hair actually held up really well today. I got this little piece sticking up right here, but <laughs> other than that, it held up pretty well. Um, I still have a lot of the definition. It actually feels really moisturized still. So I'm actually just gonna focus on my edges tonight and not even touch the rest of my hair. <laughs> so once again, I'm just gonna take a little bit more of the Curl and Shine Conditioner a little bit in my hand and I'm just going to run that over my edges take a little bit more for the tape and I'm also going to take a little bit of avocado butter that much rub it on my edges a little bit more I'm going to take my slip <laughs> Okay, I left the hair tie on there so I don't have to worry about retying it. I'm gonna pop this on. It's very loose. In the back, the hair tie is not even touching the nape. So I don't even have to worry about you know any tension or anything back there. And that is it, y'all. I will see you in the morning to show you what I do on day three here. Okay, good night. Okay, so it's the next morning. Um, my slip held up once again very nicely. So let's see what is going on under here for day three. <laughs> okay, here is day three. <laughs> All right, so my hair has pretty much drawn up a lot except for this part <laughs> right there but that's okay so my hair even though it's shrunken a lot it still feels moisturized so yes <laughs> what I'm gonna do is I'm going to once again jump in the shower and let the steam get in it and liven it up a little bit and I'll be right back to show you um how I'm gonna style it for today okay so I'm all showered and my hair has once again plumped itself back up <laughs> so all I'm gonna do is start fluffing this with my fingers and then I'm gonna see, you know, if I wanna wear it the same way that I wore it yesterday or if I wanna change it up a little bit. Okay. So I actually think that this looks really good for day three hair. Um, you know, it's got more of a fro look. There's still a lot of the pattern left from my twist. So <laughs> I could just wear it as is. And you saw that took absolutely no time at all for me to fluff my hair. So I'm loving the way my hair looks right now. Um, I will totally wear it like this. I actually wear it like this all the time. <laughs> so for today, I think I'm just gonna throw it up a little bit just to give it a different shape um, and spice it up a little bit. So I'm gonna take these bobby pins out and I still have some bangs going on. So I'm gonna leave those out today. And I'm actually going to do a hairstyle that I've done before. It's called Easy Afro Hairstyle. <laughs> um, but I'm going to change it up because I'm going to leave my bangs out. So I'm going to see how this looks. I'm just going to fluff my hair up. Then I'm going to section off the bottom half from the top half of my hair. Okay, so section off. All right, so I'm going to take a little bit more of the Curl and Shine Conditioner for my edges. You know, I'm kind of addicted to this. Have you noticed? <laughs> I'm just going to take a very little bit because I really don't need it like that. <laughs> and I'm just going to put it on my edges. Okay. This stuff actually sinks right in. It feels awesome. So I'm just going to take a baby brush and I'm going to brush that in. I'm going to clip my bangs out the way. I'm going to take a knee high that has been cut. And I'm going to take the knee high over the clips. Bring it up around my ears. And I'm going to tie it into a puff. Okay. 
just like that. I'm gonna stick a bobby pin in it. Twist the sides. Bobby pin that. <laughs> okay. And high the knee high. Fluff my bangs up a little bit. Okay. Now I'm going to remove the other clips that I put in at the bottom of my hair. And all I'm going to do is blend the gap. You can see the knee high right here. Okay. Close the gap. I'm going to take my pick and I'm going to fluff my hair up a little bit. And I'm going to pat it into the shape I want it. Because I want this to kind of be like a fro hawk look, um, I'm going to take, you know, the hairs that are here. I'm just going to push them back, you know, with the, the edge of my hand. Okay. <laughs> okay, I'm going to try to show you what I mean. <laughs> that way you don't have, you know, the baby hairs and things hanging and moving forward when you want them to move back. <laughs> okay, y'all, so this is the style I'm working with today. I'm kind of digging it with the bangs. It's kind of cute. Well, once again, I just want to show you um, that even though my hair has gotten longer, I still don't have to retwist my hair at night. And I'm able to, you know, work with my shrinkage and the frizz and things like that, you know, because I really don't want to have to spend so much time in the bathroom retwisting my hair. Um, I really want things to be as simple as possible. And this has been working for me. As long as it continues to work for me, I'm going to continue doing this. But as far as my satin like slip goes, um, I'm actually really enjoying using this. <laughs> it looks a little weird, but you know, it's been working. It works a lot better than my satin like bonnet and also even like my satin like scarf. <laughs> um, you know, this one's a little bit thicker and apparently it's holding the moisture in my hair a lot better because I have not had to moisturize my hair in three days. And I'm probably not even going to really add anything to it tonight. Um, so yeah, I'm really kind of digging this. <laughs> so I hope this was helpful. Um, I will see you all very soon in another video. Take care.